My name's Josh Hackney. I'm the executive producer on Planetside 2, the sequel to the original legendary Planetside FPS MMO. With Planetside 2, we've combined a passion, experienced team with our new advanced technology engine called Forge Light to create a competitive, compelling FPS experience set in a persistent world. Hi, my name is Matt Higby. I'm the creative director for Planetside 2. Planetside 2 showcases the largest scale combat ever seen in an online shooter. Thousands of players can directly and simultaneously compete with one another in enormous battles featuring air and ground vehicles as well as intense first-person infantry action. We have a phenomenal next-gen engine built from the ground up to provide some of the most incredible visual effects imaginable and enable the enormous scale of battles found in Planetside 2. My name is Tramel Isaac. I'm the Senior Art Director for Planetside 2. The art style for Planetside 2 is a direct evolution of Planetside 1. Using a brand new Forge Light engine, we're able to take our characters, vehicles, and weapons to the next level. Following the original design cues from Planetside 1, we've visually enhanced each of the factions while keeping the look and feel players are used to. The Terran Republic has more smooth lines and circles. The NC, the new conglomerate, is more about squares, hard edges, 45 degree angles, and 90 degree angles. The Vinyl Sovereignty, my favorite faction, is more about triangles, curves, and shapes that are more scalloped and layered, and more ornate. As you can see, we've added a higher level of detail on each of the three factions while staying true to their history. In conjunction with our brand new Asian partner, The Nine, we are truly ready to make a huge mark on the world of FPS gaming. Never before have you seen such action on a massive cooperative scale. And the level of artistic detail accompanying the intense battles, Planetside 2, is going to set a new standard. We can't wait to see you in the game. Keep up with the exciting news leading up to launch. Sony.